Today we're going to be looking at some two cent coins that are worth money. So if you have any two cent coins or you purchase coin collections, you inherit a coin collection, and you come across a two cent coin, we're going to show you what can make these coins valuable. So welcome back to Couch Collectibles. Hope you guys are having an awesome day as always. Now first up, we're going to be looking at the 1867 two cent piece. Now these coins, uh, you know, can be pretty common and not worth much and they can also be valuable in some cases as well. So for this case, this is the 1867 uh, two cent piece. Here's what the design of the coin looks like. Now it's just uh, graded as a genuine coin by PCGS because someone cleaned the coin. So do not clean your coins. That will take away from the value tremendously. Now this coin still sold for $90 in this condition, but had it not been cleaned, it would have sold for a lot more money. Now this next two cent coin sold for over $22,000. So the reason that this coin is valuable is one, it's graded at a mint state 65 red. So that means it's in very good condition. The coin grading scale goes up to 70. 70 is the best grade you can get. This is at a 65 red. Now it also has a mint error, a doubled die obverse. So there's doubling on the front of this coin. Now here's what you wanna look for. Here's an example of doubling on the 1867 two cent piece. So you want to look for that there on the lettering of the coin, very, very visible, and on the rest of the design, on the arrows uh, as well. So pay attention to your coins because that can add a lot of value to the coin. You know, in this condition, like I say, $22,000. Now if we compare it to this coin here, this coin also has that doubling on the front of the coin. However, it's in much worse condition. It's only graded at a VF20 as opposed to a high mint state 65 red grade. So that will affect the value tremendously. This coin only sold for around $220 as opposed to $22,000. Now they both have the double die, but they're in completely different conditions, completely different grades. Now here's an example of one that's kind of in the middle of those two. It's also got that doubling on the front of the coin. It's graded at an XF45. This coin sold for around $645. So the higher the grade on an example like uh, these coins, uh, the more money you're going to be able to get out of them. Now here's an 1867 coin that also sold for over $22,000. Now this does not have any mint errors all the value is in the grade itself. It's graded at a very high grade of a mint state 66 plus red by PCGS, the coin grading company. So that is where all the value is at. It means that, you know, there's not many of these coins that exist in this condition at a 66 plus red. So that uh, grade population is extremely important and uh, that's why it sold for 22,000. Now, if you wanna compare it to this coin in much worse condition, uh, the coins only sold for around $190. So a big, big difference in values based on the grade of the coin. Now, we also have the proof coin version of this coin. Now, super, super rare to have this coin, the proof coin, and to have it at a proof 66 red grade. Uh, just phenomenal, phenomenal condition coin here. This coin ended up selling at auction for over $15,000, $15,000. Uh, also keep in mind for the regular um, mintages on these coins, they, ran, they uh, made around 2.9 million of the 1867 two cent piece. So feel free to check out my other more modern coin videos where we're showing you guys newer coins that are worth money. All right, guys, don't forget to subscribe in the middle. Feel free to check out the videos to the left of me. And until tomorrow, I'll see you guys in the comment section below. This is Couch Collectibles, and this is where I disappear.